So in your lifetime, you understand me, people don't necessarily call you, check up on you, your birthday come, you know, hear from them, any little thing you are celebrating in your life. But then you drop you drop a dirty dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then everybody start jump around. Them are help with funeral arrangement. Welcome everybody, welcome to this study show. Welcome everybody, welcome to this study show. Me say one no survives and niceness you know. Welcome everybody, welcome to, to this study show. What's up everybody? This is the Steady Show and we have a very exciting show for you this evening. So, you know, in our culture as Jamaicans, we have some we have some contradictory things and we're going to talk about some of those things. Things that we do that just not make no sense. Where's the steady voice? Yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> all right, let's get into it. So, all right, for example, we don't like teeth in Jamaica, right? Or so we say, yeah? So, you know, a man go teeth something, people holler out, teeth! <laughs> Everybody now start run come with broomstick, them start run come with machete, everything. Teeth get chopped up all over and all them, something there, yeah? But at the same time, you have one look at DNG truck turn over. I don't know why DNG truck don't turn over so over. much. DNG truck, bread truck, the other day, rice, see, truck. rice truck, the other day, I see flour, I see man take off 100 pound of flour <laughs> off a truck back in the day. You understand what I say? But the other day, I see uh, crackers van turn over, you know. Yeah. I mean, I tell you, say, I want one piece of pandemonium, you know. So we are okay to go and rob the truck that turn over. Mm -hmm. You understand me? Big contradiction in Jamaica. That's true, I know where my justification for taking those things, right? Yeah. Got a truck insured. <laughs> the truck insured. Truck insured. All right, makes sense. Back. All right, so we also another cultural contradiction is that we have a problem with heinous crimes, but we commit a heinous crime yeah. to bring that perpetrator to justice. So if they did something that we perceive to be bad, like oh, you know, Jamaicans perceive certain times. So if a man chop up a woman in a community. Mm -hmm. And we catch the man, we make sure we chop him up and kill him. Right. Village justice, that kind of stuff. Right. All right, cool. All right. When it comes on to Jamaicans and church, Jamaica, Jamaica is a God-loving country, mm -hmm. right? But you have enough Jamaicans, them not going to church, you know. Mm -hmm. But the people them have to go either on Sabbath mm -hmm. or on Sunday. Mm -hmm. We will send an offering, mm -hmm. but we now go for ourselves. No. Except for a few special days, yes. of course. Easter Sabbath, Easter Sunday, watch night service. Yes. Um, yeah, we're not missing those. It's true. Christmas Sunday, Christmas Sabbath. It's true. All right. So talking about church, as a nation, we consider ourselves to be a Christian country. Yes. Um, but we seem to, even if we don't glorify them, we seem to tolerate or accept um, actions that have carried on Christian values. Right, right. So while we may not send our children out to steal, if they do steal and we know it, we accept their gifts. Yes, yes. Um, yeah, you know, and other just such examples with embrace things and yes. with cussing out people with fighting and all them yeah, stuff and here. It, yeah. And it needs to be said to you know with a whole heap of crime and violence in a Jamaica, no for them youth are come from homes where mm -hmm. Either one or both of the parents. The, the, uh, yeah, the people them will go to church. Mm -hmm. And sometimes they even know so them them son and them daughter out there at those serious That's crimes true. and they now report them to the police and so on. That's true. Yeah man, very serious thing. Hi viewers. If you like the content, remember to like the video. If you like the content, consider subscribing. And remember to hit the notification bell for new videos thank you we have a way to withhold compliment from one another too so mm -hmm. you know you pass one look at exam you get one look at job promotion or you get a job you know work long time people here say you get the look of work you know mm -hmm. <laughs> 
And they don't say nothing or a little or nothing, you know what I mean? But as soon as like, a bad news jump off, man, you feel the exam, man. Some of the relationship broke up or they fire you for your job or two friends mash up. <laughs> yeah, man, we, we eat anything, man. Nothing. You have any other? Yes, um, traditionally, well, mm. Jamaican culture dictates that we have good manners. Yes. Traditionally. Yes. But for some reason, when it comes to business transactions, We've just come to expect the very worst customer service, or the customer service is just simply non-existing. Yeah. It, that that do, it doesn't add up. Yeah, that is true. Like people does treat you anyhow. Them basically want to treat business. you. I could tell a story about a bank that I had recently, but I'm not going to do it. But long and short is, people in the customer service we don't need to treat people better. People better yeah, man. The next thing, um. Jamaicans, we keep we 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 keep malice when we when we have people have things. Yeah. <laughs> it don't take nothing for a Jamaican. It don't take nothing for a Jamaican cut you off when you have them in a things. The next thing is that Jam- a Jamaican when they in a malice with people, you know, even in a them own a house. Mm-hmm. But the same person they have malice with that is the same person that go a road mm-hmm. and them have somebody in a some kind of fight or whatever. A lot of Jamaicans are willing to jump in and yeah. help them in the fight, you know. Yeah, we might not talk to them, but we still have them back. Yeah, we still have them back. And then after the fight yeah, finished, we still not talk. We still not talk. Yeah. That's how we do it. Mm-hmm. Do you have any other? <laughs> yes. Um, a, a, a strange cultural contradiction yeah. is that for both men and women in the Jamaican mm. society, we love having children. We embrace having children. And for some reason, Probably to the same extent, mm-hmm. we fear getting married or mm-hmm. hate mm-hmm. getting married. Mm-hmm. And so I'm wondering, you know, it can't be a fear of commitment because mm-hmm. we're still committing with the child, but we're still not committing with the paper and the ring. So yes, yeah, so. Here's that. Lifetime commitment, we, we go ahead, we have the children, but we're not married. No, that, that seemed very, very contradictory. Mm-hmm. Um, so another one is that Jamaicans and how we deal with when people did. So in your lifetime, you understand me, people don't necessarily call you, check up on you, your birthday come, you know, hear from them, any little thing you are celebrating in your life. But then you drop you drop a dirty dead. Mm-hmm. And then everybody start jump around. They might help with funeral arrangements, they have the best things to say about you, you understand, then they are your dead yard, then they are funeral, people are fly down. Mm-hmm. I'm always wonder why. So that's one of the things I think we need to change in a Jamaica. You understand me? Celebrate your people them while they are alive. You understand? Because when people dead and gone, them not going to know. And sometimes the people who are alive know say, and I really that they didn't really think and I say they treat people. So we need to fix it. Let's show love to one another, especially with what we're going on in Jamaica right now. So, yeah man, I want you to tell us in the comment section, you know, what are the, some of the other contradictions that we have in our culture as Jamaicans? You understand? So again, this is the steady show saying, thanks for viewing. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Big up on yourself, Jamaica. One love, every time.